Hey guys, it's Ashley, and we are here at the soft opening of Donita's Donuts. We are so excited they are finally open. If you've driven down I-10, you've probably seen this iconic Simpson mural they have gone viral for. They have other beautiful murals created by local Houston artists, which we love to see. Definitely playing into the donut theme here. They make all of their donuts from scratch every single day. They have a great variety of classic, glazed, old-fashioned, and cake donuts on display. Be sure to like and subscribe to catch next week's video of their grand opening. You don't want to miss this. In the meantime, enjoy our review of the donuts we brought home. It's a good. Mm -hmm. What does it remind you of? The dough is super soft and squishy. It's kind of like a Hawaiian roll, but better. There's cheese inside the sausage. There's also cheese around the little sausage. It's solid. Oh, there is jalapeno in there. There's a little bit of jalapeno in that. It's not super spicy, but you can taste it. Yeah, the one I had wasn't spicy at all, mm -mm. so it's very mild spice. Mm -hmm. I like it. It's good. It's super light and airy. Oops, super light and airy. It's got a good squish to it. The glaze is nice. It's definitely sugary. But this is nice because it's not a glazed donut and then has additional like sugar and cream on top. This was like fresh out of the fryer and they glazed it with like a strawberry glaze. Are you recording? Yeah. Oh my God. All right. Yeah. What kind of filling does it have? It's like a whipped cream filling. Okay. Um, it is sweet. If you don't like sweet, this is not the donut for you because it's glazed donut. And it's got a super sugary, sweet whipped cream filling, so it's light and airy. They did have like a pastry cream filling, so if you're looking for something that's a little bit more like vanilla pudding, that would be your option. I like whipped cream. So this is like a really nice whipped cream filling. It's perfect. The donut is super airy, but it also has like a good squish and chew to it. You can tell that this was homemade. This isn't one of those like generic, like everything came pre-mixed in a bag and they just added water to it. Like this is actually homemade. It's soft. It's like, it melts in your mouth. It's a really solid donut. I'm very pleased. All right, so this is an old fashioned. This is Sterling's favorite. You can tell that that glaze actually soaked all the way into the donut. This has got like a nice little crust on it. I'm really excited to try this. Okay. That is good. It just melts in your mouth. You're going to love this. This is probably going to be your favorite one. It's got more, um, it's more dense because it's a different batter. This is like your old fashioned sour cream style donut. I see you licking your lips back there. <laughs> And it has like your classic glaze on top. This is a solid old fashioned donut. This is really good. Ooh, look at that blueberry filling. Like fresh blueberries in it. Oh, this is so good. These are one of my favorites. I love the blueberry cake donut. The blueberry flavor is definitely prominent throughout the dough. You get a good bite of everything. It's got a nice sugary glaze on top. This is great. This is gonna be the same. This is their apple fritter. It's got a nice crunch to it. Ooh, this is gonna be crispy. This is gonna be good. I'm excited. Mmm. There's lots of apple in there, lots of cinnamon sugar. It has a really nice glaze on top. I really like the crunch that it has because it's still like the same yeast dough. It's just done thinner and in the fryer with that sugar in the dough, it really has a nice caramelization, which provides a great texture and a great chew to it. Ooh, this is soft. This has cinnamon sugar in it. You can actually see the sh cinnamon sugar swirl throughout the dough. Ooh, that's good. I thought that was gonna be like a basic donut but the cinnamon is definitely prominent throughout. You can even see it kind of striped throughout the dough here and on the inside. They did a really great job with that. 
And it's also kind of appreciated because it helps break up from some of the sweetness that we've just been like going to town on these donuts since we got home. That's really good. Ooh, look at this, okay. I love how it's just like, look at that, all that glaze and all that cinnamon sugar gets in between the donut layers. Cinnamon comes through. There's a lot of cinnamon in that, in a good way. It's not overpowering. It's definitely more than the twist, but that is fantastic. I really, really enjoy that. It's not overly sweet. The cinnamon is definitely prominent throughout. This is great. 